Hello and welcome back. Uh, my name is Stimulated Universe Yasan, and uh, my name today is that because obviously I'm gonna do Simulated Universe. Uh, but first, as usual, notifications all over the place, uh, including my assignments. I could have sworn I just cleared some of these. Uh, yeah. Doing the events still. Uh, let's see, what do I need? I need some Nihility. Oh, I've got plenty of that. There we go, done. Uh, oh, since I'm here, I realized um, later that these actually have descriptions on them. I should probably read these, they might have something funny. So this is from the medical department. And the entire sorting process must be kept highly confidential. No researcher's health checkup information can be shared externally at any time. What do you want me to actually do, though? <laughs> jo Joanne has all the strats. I, I guess they just need, I don't know, pe people to file things for them, I don't know. Then Department of Insight wants uh, virus attack protection, maybe. Okay, so someone is messing with their systems. Right, that, that actually, that's actually pretty messed up. That's a lot of sabotage. And then one's from Arlen. Lead researcher has to purchase many items and invoices. Uh, wait, wait. And, the invoices and the invoices cover a huge variety of different goods. They need to be categorized. Make sure her private purchases are separate from those she made for the station. Thank you. Uh, I should have sent Asta on this one just to make it extra funny. <laughs> Make her realize the gravity of her mistake. Uh, and then Department of Cosmic Geography complains there's no timing when booking some meeting rooms. I've experienced that firsthand. And some coding errors as well. Okay, so I think there might be more than these. Just more than these four. I'll keep an eye out. Also, there's a bunch of messages. March 7th sent something. Surprise inspection. I guess this is like the one time Silver Wolf uh, sent a message. Now it's March 7th. You said to tune in to my show. Have you made it today? Uh, right, I believe the uh, version 1.4... Uh, was it the, the preview stream was today? I, I did not actually look at it. I'm sorry, March. Sorry to disappoint, I don't look at those. I will, however, take your free things. There's also a link here, which I'm kind of scared to click on, but I'll do it anyway. In fact, I'll do it because I'm scared. But yeah, it just opens my browser, no thank you. Yeah, that's just a stream. Um, thank you for the gift, though. Very nice. 600 uh, fuel. And there's also this survey. And uh, I thought, once again, it would be fun to do this on camera. How are you satisfied with the overall experience? This game is very fun. I wish you would make me do... <laughs> I wish you I could take my time with events more. But other than that, I'm very satisfied. Do you have... Oh, what's your overall evaluation of the following characters? Ambivalent and I, very satisfied. If I did not have uh, Welt, I would have pulled for him instantly. Fu, also very satisfied though. I haven't tested her in actual combat situations where she's taking a lot of damage yet. To see how truly effective she is. But I'll get there. Um, I feel kind of weird when I just put very satisfied on every single character. Um, I'm just trying to think of any reasons why I wouldn't be satisfied. <laughs> like, I, I don't know. Yeah, I'm, I'm just kind of satisfied. I'm sorry for such a bland opinion. <laughs> what aspects of him do you like? The character design is very cool. I mean, you can't go real, you can't really go wrong with dragons in general. And the character art is part of the character design. Uh, voiceover, uh, pretty good voiceover. Not my favorite voice acting in the game, but there's nothing wrong with it. Hmm. He is supposed to sound calm and composed, and for that role, the voiceover is perfectly fine. Combat experience, uh, very sad, he's just strong. Technique, 
technique is uh was the one where you spam click and you go really fast. Uh I, I feel like I'm not having a correct opinion if I just put everything as very satisfying. <laughs> but at the same time, I don't feel unsatisfied with anything. I just I'm just an easy person to satisfy. Therefore, the very nature of this uh, uh, survey is incorrect for me. Uh, next. Foo, character design looks great. Character art looks even better. Uh, the voiceover, pretty good. I haven't... I don't remember much of her combat lines. Uh, so I guess they're not very, very memorable, at least to me. Not yet. But uh, I don't think that's a cause enough for me to be unsatisfied. Especially when I haven't spent much time with the character. Combat experience, very strong. Well, again, I haven't had much of it. I guess I don't know then. Because she is a tank. And in the trial, she did take a bit of damage. But I feel like to really, truly test a tank character, you need to put them under a lot of stress. Which didn't really happen. And the technique was really cool as well. It was essentially just like every character with stack mechanics, but there was a plus on top of it in that she cannot be ambushed, which is very good. Links. Um, character design. Uh, very satisfied. Okay, here I am actually gonna put neutral on character arc, because uh, once again, her ultimate is silly and all that. I'm not the biggest fan of silly characters, like they're fine. But I prefer my seriousness in combat. It just doesn't doesn't work for me when the characters are being silly in the middle of combat. Uh, unless they're like, you know, being or taunting people, their opponents, in that way. So like the big pill that she pulls out kind of doesn't doesn't feel right to me. So I guess I will put uh, neutral. I don't quite feel unsatisfied just because there's a a lot of effort in the animation, but it's certainly not my thing. Uh, voiceover, pretty good. She has a bunch of weird squeaky uh, sound effects on her attacks in the open world, but uh, other than that, it's uh, perfectly coherent. So pretty good combat experience. I mean, she's, she's good. Once again, I haven't had much uh, testing with her, but she seemed strong and she's exactly what I needed, so pretty good and the technique was where she eats a snack uh see that one's silly as well but b because she does it before she engages in combat i'm quite satisfied with that so there we go what is your overall evaluation of the trailblaze mission of the current version of the game i feel like i would have to think about this for a while to give a good answer but i mean i enjoyed it except um a lot of the characters didn't have mouth movement when i played it Swarm Disaster. I haven't played it. Part of the reason why I'm doing Simulated Universe now, I'm hoping to like inch closer towards this. Uh, Arm oh, that was a really fun event. I enjoyed that a lot. Uh, obviously, it would be better if it was uh, voiced, like the entire thing, not just the main story, but you know, the main story was voiced, which is really good. More than you could ask for, really. So, yeah. Happy with that. Official ma mailbox or in-game customer service. No, I was not aware there was an official mailbox you could send mail to. Uh, no, I have not. In the past month, have you visited the official accounts? Yes, actually, I follow the game on Twitter. That's where I get most of my information from it. That's about it. I suppose I, I, I'm subscribed to the channel on YouTube. I don't actually watch any of the videos like at all. I can't... The last time I watched the video was like a, an old launch trailer that was there before the game even came out. I think that was the last YouTube video I watched uh, from that, from there. How would you rate the official content? I can't really answer. <laughs> I just look at the images on Twitter, that's it. I guess in terms of that I'm satisfied. Uh, in terms of other content, though, I'm honestly kind of unsatisfied because you keep posting spoilers in your stupid live streams. 
And that's that's just a problem with Hoyoko in general, I find though. Uh, but uh, that's more of a problem with me. I can't really answer. Plus, I haven't seen any in a while. Maybe they've toned it down. I have no idea. I'm too scared to check. I'll just say it's not for me and move on. Which of the following? Yes, I just mentioned this. I follow you on YouTube. I don't really watch, but I do use Twitter. And I guess I use the Hoyo Lab check-in. But I don't really follow anything game-related on there outside of the check-in, so I don't think it counts. Uh, they have <laughs> they have an official WhatsApp. <laughs> Why? All right, cool. Good for them. <laughs> Have you? Yeah, yeah. That one, that one. That's it. Have you watched guides? No. I'm thinking, maybe I like view the guide on the witty or something while I was looking for things. But I mean, I actually technically looked at a guide while I was looking to find the people at the end of the Trailblaze mission on the Zian show. So I guess technically yes. Although this has guides multiple. Oh, you related to the similar universe. I should really finish reading the question. No, that's that's a big no. Why haven't you viewed? I haven't played it. Also, it's not my thing. I don't need strategy guides, I like to fail and learn from it, unless I'm short on time. There we go. Have you watched the special program? No. Um, higher refresh uh, rate supports. Can't see my keyboard. Please. Any actual uh, suggestions? I don't think so. I, I don't feel like sitting here and thinking of something. I'll just uh, leave it at that. So there we go. Those are my opinions. And another mail, give me that. Cool, there's also a bunch of notices, no doubt related to the, yeah, the special program, which apparently was March themed. I guess she was the host. Ooh. I guess that's an upcoming character then. Maybe from the next planet? Would be cool. Which of the Radiance check-in... Oh yeah, this is a new event that's already out. And the survey... I did uh, claim this already today. There's a bunch of free solar jades here. Uh, 800 total. Thank you very much, I'll take it. And finally, a couple of messages from Fu. Wow, it feels weird not seeing that Don Heng mission sitting there at the top now. It kinda... It kind of doesn't feel right. I kind of miss seeing it there, but... <laughs> it's a good thing that it's not there. Oh wow. Okay, let's see. I did not divine personal fortunes. Come on, you can divine my fortune, right? If I pester you enough, you will do it, please. Uh, let's see here. No affinity. I'm trying to think of what real life website this would be based on. I don't know. To receive invitations to answer some of the questions posted there. You would be good at that, probably. Look at this one. How can a leader maximize their direct reports motivation to work? Uh, the, the answer to that is a bonus payment. Just offer a bonus and they'll do it really quick. Because you're an outstanding leader. <laughs> yeah. I would expect this to be a pace of takes you. Okay, she's being very poetic about it. 
right. Decent answer. You could get to the point faster, but it's a good. Sure. Don't use the rest as, as an example, because <laughs> at that point you're you're just gonna have to write discipline, discipline, and discipline. <laughs> Jeez, anything <laughs> you want to post? Uh, the troubles of Fu. I guess she is a uh, a subordinate and a leader as well. But I feel like she's more of a leader than a subordinate. She's only occasionally a subordinate uh, to the general. Let's see, another message. I want to drink sugary drinks. Could you, could you please make more for me? It looks like she was drunk. <laughs> Recalled, oh no. <laughs> I should have been there to see it. Why can't I recall the first one? This is a clear request. I can do that. Wait a few minutes, I'll be right there. Uh huh. Is she embarrassed? Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, I think she was asking, like, someone to get her some drinks, but then she's messaged the wrong number, and now she's embarrassed for being exposed of liking, I don't know, soft drinks. Scandalous. The tough and mighty foo likes sweet things. Amazing. How embarrassing. Although her answer, her cover-up, sounds very convincing, I do say. Yeah, you don't need to excuse yourself. Come on, you can do it, yes. She was honest. Good job, Fu. I'm proud of you. It's on the list of things to do. Alright, so next time I go looking for Fu's help, I should bring, like, uh, a, a pack of uh, Pepsi or something. <laughs> Alright, that's everything. Everything's caught up. No notifications, everything nice and not red on my screen. Looks beautiful. It is time for the simulated universe. Uh, today we're gonna be doing World 4, finally. I've been farming World 3 for months now. Excited to unlock it. And, uh... Right, this reset as well. I have a ton of these things as well that I've been saving up, stocking up. So while I'm here, first of all, I want to buy two of these really quick to max uh, superimpose the uh, this one, this light comb that I bought for the main character. And since I have eight left over, that's the perfect amount to buy a new one. So this is the destruction one. I think I will go for the destruction one. Uh, I got one for my preservation main character, so now I'll get one for my destruction main character. <laughs> and my main character will just hoard all the five star light cones. Although I guess I have a hunt one, there's no hunt main character yet. Yet. I better see it soon. Uh, but obviously not gonna use it this episode. I have to rank it up and all. And uh, yeah, since I've been farming uh, the Simulity Universe every week off camera, I have a ton of rewards here. I got all the hunt blessings, I got all the destruction blessings, I got most of the remembrance blessings except for the... Uh, I believe except for the... Uh, what do you call those? The, uh, the path resonance things. I believe that's... The only thing I'm missing for Remembrance, I could be wrong though. I've got tons of events. 
there's these categories seem different, I don't remember this. Oh, Swarm Disaster. I haven't done anything in the Swarm Disaster. But I have a bunch of uh, things that appear in it as well, I guess, that I've done. Uh, but I'll check all these things out, I think, the next episode or soon. Oh, I'll do another, like, uh, Lore Dunhang roleplay video where I read just everything <laughs> for a couple hours. Uh, but today... Oh, right, Ability Tree as well. I've been saving up stocking my Ability Points. I have 6,590. Finally, I guess I cash those in. So let's see, it is time to purchase some upgrades. Attack boost 2, give me that 40 attack, thank you. 65 HP for everything, beautiful. When selecting a blessing in the simulated universe, after defeating enemies you can consume cosmic fragments. So reset the blessing for one time only. So there's a, uh, a curio that lets you do that, but I guess I can do it uh, once for free now. Uh, each run, or each time I get a blessing, I'm not sure. We'll see. Uh, cool. I guess it's each time then. That's pretty good. All blessing of trailblaze effects are enhanced. Uh, I don't know what this means. <laughs> trailblaze. Any of these effects called trailblaze effects? No. I don't know what this means. All blessings? Are these just like, um, like, well, the blessings? Like the, the preservation blessings, hunt blessings, all of those are increased? That sounds crazy. Let me take a look. Let's go to the index blessings and let me find one with percentages. Like this one, increases crit rate by 11 or 16. If I then buy my ability... Uh, this one. It becomes not the store. Uh, index blessings hunt. This one. No, it's the same. I don't know what that means. Uh, oh well. I might have to look it up. All right, give me more attack. Forty-five, thirty-five defense. That's so good. That's so so good. Alright, Resonance Formation 2. After obtaining 10 blessings from the chosen path of exploration, one extra Resonance Formation can be activated. I think I saw this, uh... I checked this one ahead of time before, and yeah, it sounds so good. So basically, we can have two different uh, Resonance Formations now. If you get 10 blessings, you can stack them, you can do some crazy things with that. And you deal 15% more damage with it. Beautiful. I feel like I'm gonna breeze through this World 4 with this, but we'll see. We'll see. In the simulated universe, the starting cosmic fragments amount increased by 50, so 50 free cosmic fragments every run. Don't mind if I do. Another 50 attack, another 40 defense, another 75 max HP. Insane. Let's see. Extra blessings. You can select an extra blessing after winning a battle for the first time. What? So the first time I win a fight, I get double blessings. What if I, like, catch a Trotter on my first time? That's just a free blessing. I feel like I'm almost too overpowered now. But maybe World 4 is that hard, we'll see. Another 60 attack, another 45 defense, another 80 HP. I'm unlocking so many things, I need to sip some water, my mouth's getting dry. <laughs> ah. After obtaining 14 blessings from the chosen path, one extra resonance formation can be activated. So if you get 14 blessings, you get all three resonance formations, which is crazy. Like, you can do some insane things with that. Like, if you get all the hunt resonance formations, like, you get so many extra turns and damage, it's ridiculous. Okay. And then everyone gets 5% crit. Expert Tree Climber, thank you. I am climbing a lot. Energy Recharge Booster. Uh, pet Resonance Energy increases by 20 upon entering battle. Not sure how much it takes for it to activate. Probably like 100 or something. So 
That's really good. Let's you spam that ability more on normal fights instead of just saving it for bosses. Very convenient. Oh, oh, speed. Speed, my one true love. More speed. Oh, I'm in tears. Uh, 60 attack, 45 defense. And we finally reached the end. Oh, that was a lot. There's not even much left. What's the final one? I think I read this one too. Yeah, it gives initial energy. So you start with full energy and each time you enter an elite or a boss, your energy recharges to full, which allows you to spam your ultimate as you please in normal fights, which is something I cannot do right now. Uh, but that's for later. Oh, let's see. World 4 and a ton of first clear rewards. I honestly forgot about these. <laughs> Did I get first clear uh, rewards? I get free Herda. Two of these, nice. Okay. And the new things. I don't get, uh, interesting. So, in World 3, I've moved up to doing the second uh, tier of this. Once I leveled up my characters in this current uh, uh, equilibrium level. And they start dropping 5 star uh, things. I forgot what these are called. <laughs> uh, they're not relics, right? They're called something else. I forgot. I'm sorry. But in World 4, I expected the first one to drop uh, 5 stars as well, but it doesn't. Weird. Well, okay. Let's see. Recommended level 50. And World 3, 2 was recommended 62. So this is actually probably going to be a breeze. I actually expected this to be really tough. Oh, Svarov's there. But since this is going to be probably not that difficult, then I might try some fun characters. I was going to bring my A-team. You know, Walt, Asta, Bailu. But uh, we can try out some other things, maybe. Let's see. Fire seems like a good one to bring, so maybe I should bring Hook. Yeah, so we'll do main character. Oh, I guess I should do a shield uh, main character then. Let me swap really quick. Give me that super in position. Can I see the effect? Yes, I can. So it's 14, uh, 28, 21. Up to 24, 32, 16. Beautiful. So tanky. Okay, so. No, not World 3. We're doing World 4 today, game. Main character. Uh, I'll still use Bailu because he's weak to electric Swarag. Swarag complete. Uh, what does that say? Complete projection produced by compromised codes. Right. Uh, so I will still bring Bailu, because he's weak to electric. Where is Bailu? There she is. And then Hook, as I said. And finally, I don't know, should I bring down Hang maybe? Sure, let's bring down Hang. Yeah, why not? Boom. Oh, okay, so... Since I've gotten all the blessings for the hunt and destruction, I wanna I don't wanna pick them anymore. Instead, let's see. For relation, I don't really do follow-up attacks with this team. Remembrance is good for like freezing and debuffs, which I don't really do. So I guess we'll go preservation. There we go. Confirm path. I need to get 14 blessings. That's honestly tough to do. I don't think. I can do that, but I will try my best. Although getting a new free blessing at the start of each run is pretty good. Um, hmm. So usually I go for a curio at the start. Um, but maybe it's good for, to go for a blessing just to try and get, you know, 14 blessings of preservation. Let's, let's, let's do it. There we go, preservation. When entering battle, all characters gain a shield. Cool. I'll take that. Um, and while I'm here, let me unlock Hook's extra trace ability. Uh, Navet? Naviet? I'm not sure what that word is or means. 
or how to pronounce it. The chance to resist crowd control debuffs increased by 35. Beautiful. So 35% chance to resist frozen, imprisonment, entangle, all that. Beautiful. And 6% attack, I'll take it. As for Don Heng, he gets faster than light. He is pretty fast within his ultimate. After launching an attack, there's a 50% fixed chance to increase the speed by 20% for two turns. Give me that. Give me that. Any attack? Any attack. Beautiful. Oh, dude, that's, that's a good... That's a good bonus ability. Uh, also, I think I forgot to switch his relics. Uh, give me another second. Okay, done and done. I'm still using the same, like... <laughs> uh, relics that I had, like... God knows how many episodes ago when I first cleared World 3 and Rage leveled a bunch of relics. Still using those exact same ones. I've been swapping them between characters. Okay, let's get a move on. This guy's weak to fire, which is weird. I think this actually gets engaged with Blink here. I could be wrong. Let's see. No interest in Double speed as usual. It was okay to engage with Wind. Let's see it. Increase your speed on him. Oh well, I am very strong. Die. Maybe not too strong. But good. <clears throat> oh, right. <laughs> My god. It's been so long since I've done simulated universe, like, new stages that I forgot this happens. <laughs> Genuinely. <laughs> I, X, or X, or I don't know, I forgot, someone pronounced this I think and I forgot how they did it. Looks like he's actually a slime or something. So the Eon on the hill is like a big vortex slime thing that's eating planets or maybe it's like a black hole I guess. Okay, let's see, for some reason you're surrounded by darkness, or sucked into darkness, gravitational fields. Yeah, so he's like a black hole, nihility. Return all to nothing. Mm -hmm. Do I die again? <laughs> Never really looked at what these diagrams are behind her. I see some vitals. My party members, I guess. Maybe my blessings or stats. Not sure what that is. My rewards, maybe? So I've just been absorbed into nothing. Oh, interesting. Ultimate stealth, huh? Wow. You need some, like, immediate mental help if Nihildi's near you. That's true. But uh, second-hand care is still good. So they do have a bit of sentience. I wasn't quite sure. I mean, they have eyes, but still. So being near the Nihility just drives you insane, that's so cool. And I get the Nihility Blessing. But I don't want the Nihility Blessing. Let's see though, these are all new. If an enemy is under any DOT status when receiving an attack, they will take damage from a random DOT on them. Insane. That's insane, wow. If an enemy weakness is broken after receiving an attack, there is a chance for them to be- why can I not scroll? Uh, there we go. There's a chance for them to inflict it with a random DOT. I guess I will take this. I suppose Hook inflicts a DOT, but her DOT doesn't do too much. I'd rather inflict a random one. Thank you. <sighs> okay, well, now I have to make a hard choice. Do I take a new blessing, or do I take a preservation blessing? I'm a big fan of Stellar Jade, so I, I think I will take the new one. <laughs> Hopefully that's not a mistake. I don't foresee this being difficult. I thought this would be difficult, but after looking at all the facts, I don't think this will be difficult. 
But if I'm wrong, I will suffer the consequences. Nice. Dunhang's just kind of farming. I wanted other characters to get energy, but... Dunhang's kind of brutal. Oh, there we go. Preservation, give me that. I don't care what it says, just give me it. When you break, you gain shield. Cool. I really want to find, like, the crit damage and crit rate uh, preservation blessings. Those are the really good ones. Alright, come here. Otherwise, I think I will struggle to find much damage increase on preservation. Besides the uh, three-star blessings. Do other characters actually get to act here? Nice. Hook, do your thing. Nice. And hopefully Bao can kill this. Cool. Energy is looking nice. Another new one. Every time an enemy takes damage from a DOT, a random ally regenerates energy. That's really strong. And it's new, so I'll take it. And then we always go occurrence. Always. Always go occurrence. It's the correct choice every time. It never goes wrong. Looks like I got the pixel thing again. I've seen this dialogue many times. 200 fragments. I think I want more blessings. Just trying to get as many preservation things as possible. Okay, so there. I got nothing new and nothing from preservation, so I'll do a reroll. And, okay, once again, I'm forced to choose between Stellar Jades and... Ah, oh, no, okay, I want this so bad. I'm sorry. But this is, like, the one blessing I'm looking for. I'll take it. And there it is. Path Resonance Preservation. Look at them. So huge and swole. After using the Path Resonance, deals physical damage. Okay, so preservation is uh, associated with physical. I did not expect that. I don't know what I expected. In hindsight, it makes sense. <laughs> Based on the max heat, max damage that can be absorbed by shields on all allies. Hmm, okay. So I want to make sure I activate the talent, or not the talent book, the um, light cones effect on the main character before I use that. And we got nothing useful again, so I'll reset. I'm kind of wasting a lot of fragments, but hopefully it's good. Okay, so I got... This one's kind of useless. Advancing my actions forward, I'm a big fan of speed. Or energy. I like speed. Energy is really good though, but... I like speed just a bit more. Alright, let's go another occurrence. I'm not sure what that is. Let's find out. When did I take damage? I guess the characters were damaged. Okay. I feel like I've seen this before. Oh yeah, this is the insect nest. This is really good. If I go in... I get a negative curio, which is actually a positive one, and a 3-star blessing. So I get this. Upon entering battle, a character will be parasiticized, which will make them take damage at the start of every turn. But also it increases their attack by 50%, so that's just that's just a positive, honestly. Ooh, nice, I got preservation 3-star, perfect. And entering, entering battle, you gain a special shield, perfect. That also synergizes with the uh, path resonance, very nice. I feel like I'm stacked already, this is only the first elite. We'll make him friendly by making him defective. Uh, let me do we'll this. Uh, this, this, and this. Lots of bucks. If nothing else, this team, this team's techniques overlap very well. Move carefully. Why do I have so much shield already? Great question. But I will wait for a bit before I use it. Uh, I will, however, the use my ultimates. Revealed in an instant. Get him, Dalhan. Do a crit. I believe in you. Nice. Yeah, I feel like this is gonna be entirely too easy. Even without my 18. Alright, you just uh you just hit him honestly. 
And now I'll use the thing because I have about as much shield as I can recently get. 10k, not bad. Hook the other thing. This thing's already almost dead. Blast them. And I'm breaking with Lance. This fight is already over. I'm using preservation. This team is not fast. Okay, yeah, this is gonna be way too easy. I really expected World 4 to be difficult, honestly. But it just isn't. <laughs> oh, let's see, in the hill, the 3 stars. Every time an enemy takes damage from a DOT, apply one stack of suspicion on them. That sounds funny. What is what is suspicion? Debuff brought by Nihility increases DOT taken by one stack up to 99. Up to 99 damage over time increase. It's pretty insane. But it's probably really hard to stack it that far. Every time an enemy is afflicted with DOT, they take three suspicion. Um, let's do this. This seems a bit better to me. Hook will be applying a bunch of those. That, that, that's kind of it, I guess. Maybe this is better then, because I don't really have that many uh, DOTs. Alright. I've convinced myself. Um, cheese is really good. Space Sign Prism, yeah, no, it's a cheese. But I think I want glue. Get more of those three star blessings. Immersion rewards, I don't really care. <laughs> These are now five star things, so I just don't care. Next. Oop. Let's see, what do you have for me, Herda? Let's do two random enhances. I'm a big fan of that one. Okay, let's see. So this became. Okay, so that's what I can actually inflict on them. And now, I can also dispel. Or, well, it's guaranteed to, probably. Each time I break them. Oh, and I got the 3 star, nice. So now instead of just 1% shield, it's 10%. Beautiful. And it also gains more shield from my shields. And every two turns... Can it, wait, can it not be regained? Oh no, that was already a thing at the end of the description, okay. Bye, Herda. Back here. Don't see anything special. No, uh... Uh... Glitch Tyrios. Or Trotters. A bit unfortunate. Oh well. We have Dunham. Come here. Get him done. Time to go okay. on the, the enemy didn't actually get one shot this time. Okay. I guess I will defend them. Indestructible. And you can hit um, this one. Oh, no. Okay, yeah, enemies are getting tougher. Cool, cool. Won't be too, too easy then. Fortunately for them, I'm even tougher. Uh, kill him. Nice. Let's see, you need some energy. Can you kill this? No, not even close. Oh, she inflicted burn without her enhanced still just there. I didn't... No. Yeah, she does. She doesn't flick burn on her normal steel. I thought it had to be enhanced for her to do that. I was incorrect. Okay, so maybe I should have gotten the other... ...and heal the 3 star blessing instead then. Oh well. And Don has the uh, spider effect on him, so he takes a bunch of uh, damage each time he starts his turn, but also deals a ton more damage. Which is a great trade-off. I'll take it any time. Oh, I'm 
another... Oh right, I did get the glue. Oh, silly me. After attaching enemies, the attacking character deals quick damage based on the current shield effect of the character. Yeah, seems really good. I have a ton of shield. I'm stacking tons of preservation blessings. I should be get I should get uh, the resonance thing soon. Who do we have here? Some silly weak enemies. Get him. The spider Time debuff can actually kill Don, so I should be a bit careful. Uh, just get him. They're all very weak. It's kind of fine. Just, just hit them. Yeah. And by we can heal Don. Don't worry uh, about me. No double bounce on him, unfortunately. Clemency? Never heard of it. Yep, he really is dealing a lot of damage, wow. Did you say another preservation blessing? Thank you very much. And this is the good one too. Nice. Thank you very much. Alright, there we go. Or I guess resonance formation is what it's called. Let's see here. Applies a shield and amber. <laughs> What's amber? The character with a shield receives damage that exceeds the max damage that can be absorbed by the shield. The excess damage becomes invalid once. How long does Amber last if it's permanent? That's crazy. Uh, let's see what else though. The attacks of path resonance. Oh, so the, the path resonance is crits when you use it. Okay. The higher the crit damage. That seems pretty good too. When you enter battle, it regenerates energy. Or I could just get a ton of recharge on it. <sighs> um, honestly, the recharge sounds kind of good, but I'm also a big fan of things critting. So I think I will take this. Okay. And one more enemy. Yeah. Step aside. I have no interest. Time to go on the offensive. Good debuffs. Time to make some You can that, How much shield on him has that? Or just it just doesn't have help. So his shields are exaggerated. Reroll. Nice. Oh, I got the other good one. They're being hit. Characters gain a shield. No, don't care. Give me the crit damage. Nice. Okay, so we have the main combat and the main encounter. Encounters are usually harder and have better rewards, so obviously. Let's go here. What do you have for me? This is the tavern. Right. Yeah, so I can choose to fight one guy, another guy, or both. Let's go. Ouch. Should I just open with my thing? No, I should wait to get a bit more shield from the main character. Although I guess I can do this. Lance of Blaze. Then I'll use this. Oh, I didn't notice the glass shatter effect before. That's really not really pretty. The truth of life and death. And a ton of damage. Instant. Uh I guess this guy's closer to death? Sure. This sanctuary 
Let's just get this guy out of the picture. Although this guy summons minions, maybe I want him out of the picture. A little too late now. Not a scratch. Yeah, I should have saved my flame once actually. But it's fine. I can do this. Not quite enough, huh? Your ultimate is a single target. I suppose I'll, I'll hit him because uh, he does break more damage as well. And get the AoE thing. That was really good, almost stole the side thing. And Bailu, you healed on Hank. He's taking a ton of damage from the Kirio. Nice full heal. And you can just heal that one. Speed boost, nice. Alright, oh, for Don Hank's talent, you want him to be targeted by allies' skills anyway. So him taking damage and then me healing him with Bailu is actually just good synergy. I knew that. All part of the plan. Um... I guess I can... I, I don't really need to taunt with the main character. Yeah, I just hit this guy. To the finish. Then hook him, break him. Boom. Now you don't. It's too late to repent. And on him can start working on this guy. Or finishing him. The truth of life and death revealed in this sanctuary is but a vision. Get him. Ah, oh, close, close. Let me your wounds. And yeah, you might as well heal him, I guess. Why not? Oh, he gets another Don't turn. He's that fast. Me. Nice. I could just end him here with the resonance, but there's no need to. Might as well save it. Can you hook? No match for Pitch Dark Hook the Great. And right, I do get uh, the Hunt Blessing. Or a Hunt Blessing. Uh, specifically. Um, I'll just take some more crit rate, thank you. Big fan of that one. Ooh, what's this? After characters launch, uh, <laughs> launch follow up attacks, deals aftertaste. Well, unfortunately for me, I did not have those. Um, actually, all of these want me to have follow up attacks, so I guess I might as well take the three star one, since none of those actually do anything for me anyway. All right, and now oh, it's a lead time. Let's see if this one's. As easy. Certainly isn't friendly. I actually only have uh, three, three things. Technique points. Let's go this for Don Hangs, yours, and Hooks. Bows is hardly necessary. <laughs> Not taking damage anyway. Oh wow, I have to fight against this thing as my elite. It's actually incredibly annoying. I should do this before she damages me much. 25k, that's insane. Get her. She stands no chance. Okay, Don Hank slows her down and speeds himself up. Actually, really liking what he's doing. And again, there's just no reason to taunt. I'm not going to be taking damage either way. There's zero point. Just get him. Her. Oh, I should have healed on him, actually. Whoops. Oh well. Right, the mind stacks. Get her. Get her fast. Oh, I'm actually going to break her. She's, she's just dead. I don't need to use on him as ultimate I will. Oh, I didn't crit, unfortunate. Hit her. Look at all these debuffs, too. 
absolutely destroyed. Wait, does she get Never heard of it. a debuff each time she's hit while she's broken? Is that how that works? Wait. I think so, she just got bleed reapplied to her again. So that a Nihility 3 star blessing works like that. I thought it's like once once per break she gets an extra debuff, but no, it's each time you hit her while she's broken. Well, it's quite a bit better than I thought. But unfortunately it is random. So I did not get a uh, shock on her. Step aside. I have no interest in stoking conflict. I have much interest in getting her uh, six feet under though. Looks like she might not die here. Ah, let's just go for it. I'm not gonna heal the bubble. Let's go for the kill. And it paid off. I suppose I always had lance and other ultimates if I needed it. Oh, another Nihility thing. At the start of an enemy's turn, all DOT sources on it are right, triggered one extra time. If you upgrade this, does it become two extra times? Because that's absolutely cracked. Okay, let's see. What do I have? I have the Trapezoid die. Could be good. I kind of like this insect web, honestly, though. I think I'll just take the reduction dice. Always fun. And we're moving on. Give me those. What's popping her up? What do you have for me? I'll take that once again. Big fan of it. More speed. Big fan of that. At this point, DOT damage being increased is actually just straight up good for me. Actually, a, a decent amount of damage that I do is coming from DOTs. Okay. One more enemy. Let's get the heal for Dawn. And let's just engage with her. These light cone robots hate them. Time to go on the offensive. To the finish. Kill them all. Time to surrender. Oh, you, you can actually something. see the quake damage. I never I didn't quite notice ever. There's like a shatter effect when the characters attack. Yeah, look at that. Get a bunch of turns. Ha, ah, you advanced the wrong one, fool. Oh, man, I cannot I cannot wait to play Nihility with my Kafka team. It's gonna be so fun. Step aside. I have no interest in stoking conflict. Right. You can just kill that guy. You can take down guard. this guy's shield. <laughs> and hope maybe you can kill it. No, not even close. Like Actually. Maybe with her help. It's too late to repent. Ah, you just killed this guy. I should have had Hook kill him. I didn't realize I'm hitting this fast enough to get another turn there. Although it didn't really matter. Dead. No preservation. Still no preservation, sad. I'll take a bit of more speed then. And preservation. Oh, or money. Extends the duration of these debuffs by one turn. Very well. Very well. And we'll go encounter once again. Give me that. Alright, what do you have for me? Is this the same thing? Yeah, it's the exact same thing. But this time it's Remembrance and Destruction. Let's go. Hit him with the Move thing. Let me just unload all my ultimates. Life and death, revealed in an instant, this sanctuary. It's but a vision! Right. And a vision is the last thing you'll see. Yeah. Yeah. 
for style points. Lance ablaze! Flaming Lance! Forward! I think the Flaming Lance is my new favorite character. Lance at the ready. It sure is. Rapture. And Hook, you can kill that guy. What is she saying her ultimate again? I forgot. I can't quite make it out. And by what you really need to heal from him at this point. Don't worry nice, about that was me. a bad big heal. Uh, might as well finish this guy, I suppose. He's not quite dead. That probably makes him dead. Nah. Fortunate. But at this point I'm gonna stop attacking him because he's gonna go. die from debuffs. <laughs> right, he resists fire. How annoying. Rude guy. Get him. I can pay for his crimes. Ah, uh, Bailu doesn't Love need to heal here. Clemency? Never heard of it. Get him. The sanctuary. The truth of life and death. Revealed this sanctuary is but a vision. Ah, oh, no crit. Sad. Always sad. But I'm never gonna. Well, obviously I'm gonna build on Hang at some point. But when I'm gonna build on Hang, I'm gonna build him for like 100% crit rate. Unacceptable when he doesn't crit. Could do uh, the shield chatter at this point, but I say shield chatter is for the resonance, but I, I, there's no need to. These guys are just dying in a timely manner as it is. Oh, they actually punched through the shield for once. Oh, that's crazy. And unappreciated. I'm still not gonna defend. <laughs> I'd rather Dunhang get the skill, so I'll attack with, do a normal attack with uh, Hook. Whoop. And let's do another Sanctuary. The truth of life and death. His this ultimate has like no energy cost. Nice. Uh, no preservation there. Oh wait, right. This is always a rem remembrance. Silly me. My characters deal damage to enemies. Small chance to freeze the enemy. I guess I will take that. Oh, all allies split incoming damage or max HP increase. I mean, sure, why not? Makes Biolu's ultimate easier to use. And oh, I get double blessings because of my things. Nice. Uh, after breaking an enemy's weakness, apply this action. Perfect. And did you see more shield? Thank you very much. And the curio is done. Final bit of respite. And some upgrades. Let's see. Oh, I can't upgrade any of my uh three star blessings because I just wasted thirty fragments like an idiot. In that case, I think I'll upgrade my uh, crit rate and call it a day. Let's go, Svarog. Uh, Time to fight you once again. Blue, How many times have I fought Svarog now from different sources? I fought him. I fought Svarog, Svarog once. I fought him at the brawl tournament thing once. I fought him at the mining event once, and now it's here. Okay, set up the usual stuff. Plus, by loop. And let's go. 
Look at this mess. Shatter him instantly. Boom. Oh wow. <laughs> My god. <laughs> that little beat at a third of his health bar. More than a third. Okay, let's see what Don Hang does. Nice. He's already at half. Oh, I should have expected this. And I did, that's why I saved flaming lights. Though it's not quite enough. Oh, I say that, but like... Oh, it froze him too, oh my god. Okay, Swarag, I'm sorry, but I don't think you're gonna have much of a fight this time around. You're just gonna kind of die instantly. Can't even hook him. Might as well. Might as well. I really cannot make out what she says in her ultimate. Like, not, not at all. Oh, you bastard, you heal. I should have considered that. It's too late to repent. Just go for it. Rush him down. I'm on guard. And yeah, just hit him. To the finish. Okay, soon. What do you have for me? Tactical support. Oh, those are bigger. I almost have my uh, formation again. That hurts. Not a scratch. Not a scratch. But the bleed, I believe, bypasses shield, doesn't it? Am I misremembering? I feel like it does, doesn't it? Alright, let's see if they're tough enough to take this. They were not lost, oh my god. Such insane damage. Uh, let me heal Dunham, sure. I wasn't paying attention. Did she take damage? Not sure. Let's see if this can deliver. The truth of life and death. This sanctuary is but a vision. Do a crit, do a crit. How do you not crit? I buffed my crit rate and everything. He's still just about dead. Oh, it did not bypass the shield. Oh, beautiful. Ah, unfortunate. Live at 4%. Oh. That almost did damage. You try your best, Varog. I applaud your effort. I really do, but... You're gonna have to try harder than that. Final phase. Okay, this is where the fun stuff starts. That thing imprisons people. Wish I had an ultimate here. Why well, hope. Okay, yeah, we need to free her. Let's aim for the hand. Get her out of there. That thing is tanky, wow. Okay, this might not be that easy. But Don Hank should be able to do it. Fine, you attack the tank, you fool. And that didn't really do anything. The truth of life and death revealed in an This sanctuary. should just kill it, right? Is but a vision. Not quite. Annoying. Oh well, that's a big freeze effect. Oh actually. Is that new? I feel like before, at some point, I froze one of these hands, but it's floating, so I kind of froze it midair. Did they add this effect to make stuff like. for stuff to make sense to be frozen midair? I feel like that's new. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that was always a thing. I'm not sure. But anyway, I got hooked back, and she's back with a vengeance. And would you look at that, my. Uh, I'm gonna call it shield shatter, because that's just a fun thing to call it, and it kind of shatters, and it's a shield thing. And my shield shatter is up. Goodbye, Swarok. Okay, 
this is still has a, it's not break ball left though. Alright, what are you after me? Oh god, another one. But yeah, I'm gonna use uh Bylo's ultimate in case she gets captured. As if she does and I fail to kill the hand fast enough, the down hand might be in trouble, but with this she should be fine anyway. Let's see. High risk individual. Oh the main character. Yeah, she needs to be saved. Let's go. Don't think he's gonna get his ultimate, so this should be fine. Look, listen, feel and easy to do. Clemency. Yeah. The truth of life in fact, might even be too much to use this. He has two debuffs. Now nah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna not mess with it. It's but a vision. Right. Now you crit, huh? Oh, and he breaks all. Nice. It's too late to repent. How many turns do you get in a row? What the hell? <laughs> That's his th third turn in a row. I don't even have like any crazy like speed boost blessings from the hunt. He's just that fast. Wow. Running the laps around everyone here. And he throws him. It's over. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. What the hell was that debuff damage? My god. Why would kill him? Always funny. You and your family are dead now. I hereby pronounce this expedition a success. It is. That was entirely too easy. I was really like mentally preparing myself for a difficult time. I expected struggle, I expected peril, but I kind of sweep this. <laughs> I was too ready. A finger in every pie, was it? And I heard it give me that. Thank you. And world 5 is unlocked now. Cool. Well, I wonder where uh, the swarm disaster is. I guess it's like world 8. The secret world unlocks after world 7 or something. Give me my point rewards as well, thank you very much. Um, and let me go to the store and get one of these. So did I unlock, uh, yeah I unlocked the difficulty level 2 which where the things actually drop and where the difficulty actually increases. Uh, but I won't do that today. I'm not sure if I want to do this on camera because it's just more of the same but it's just a lot more difficult. Uh, my intention was to get this, and then I was gonna do a temple, because I'm only... Oh right, I got hurt as well. What did you get? Eidolon number 4. Wow, I'm already at 4, huh? Hit where it hurts. When talent is triggered, damage increases by 10%. Like, permanently? Okay, seems good. Uh, yeah, I have 9 of these, but I'm just a bit shy. From getting it so instead I'll just uh, level up links really quick uh, ascend her and then I get one there we go uh, let's do a temple to end the episode come on ah no five star I, I must be getting close to pity at this point right it's been forever since I saw 5 star. Oh no, it hasn't been forever. I pulled a, a Hunt Life Cone. Never mind, I'm not close to pity at all then. Oh, that's a new book. A little Bronya and Kakalia. When she had a smile on her face. Memories of the past. Uh, that's Harmony. We'll see it in a bit. Uh, looks like that's about it. Oh, another one! Another new one! Under the blue sky! Who is that? Okay, that's, that, that must be some young characters as well, but I have no clue who they are. Okay, let me look at this one first. Memories of the past. Harmony. Break, dam break effect by 28 when the fair attacks additionally generates 4 energy. Once per turn. Um... I don't, I'm not aware of any Harmony characters that like to inflict a lot of break bar damage, so I don't think this is too amazing for anyone that I can think of. 
And this one's for destruction. Let's see, increases attack by 16. Nice. When the bearer defeats an enemy, you get crit. You get 12% crit for three turns. That's really good. But who is that in the picture? Were you that one character that we saw at the end of the Zienjo cutscene? Because these clothes here kind of look uh, Zienjo to me. Maybe she's that one uh, girl, but now she's all grown up, so this is her as a child, but I'm not sure who this is then. At all. Huh. It's not... It's not the android, no, no way. Androids don't age like that. Uh, what do you want from me? Right, another one of those finished, uh... I got an achievement as well, oh. Alright, fine, I'll check it out. Malicious occupation in public space. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I mean, I understand what you mean. That can be, in fact, a, a bad thing, but like the way it's worded is extremely funny. From the Department of Cosmic Geography, again. Mm -hmm. Bullying. Hilarious. Alright. And I got an achievement from uh, Simulant Universe. Right, right. Activate abilities in the tree 26 times. That feels good. A finger in every pie, that's what it said. Have blessings from six or more pets, did I? Wow. Yeah, I guess I did a bunch of those uh, brawl things, which gave me like four different. Uh, types of blessings. And finally, this thing wants something for me. Alright. Almost done with this. Uh, but that will be it for this episode. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Next episode... I don't know. I think I might do World 5. I don't think I will do World uh, 4 2 on camera. Uh... But if I cannot do World 5, I didn't actually check, then I'll read a bunch of lore. So, see you then.